Good morning YouTube, Jason Andrews, the All-American Driver. Today we're installing the Corsa slash Volant cold air intake system. Now some of you guys might remember about a year ago I actually installed this intake on my truck. But almost immediately after installing it, you know, I kind of went through all those problems which ultimately led to me getting a new motor in this truck. So I never really got to enjoy this intake or, or even experience it. So. I do remember it kind of being um, a little bit of a hassle by myself last time, so I'm going over to Patrick's at Those Guys Customs in Bremerton. He's going to take on this small little job. Uh, it was a kind of a pain, so I'm stopping to get him some donuts and coffee, you know, and I'm going to stick around just in case he needs any help or, uh, you know, probably just film some B-roll or whatever. So let me go in. Fuel level is low. Let me go in, get some donuts, grab some coffee, and then, uh, yeah, we'll head over to those guys' customs. Okay, so Patrick, if you watch this, and this turns out to be a pain in the ass, I mean, this is why I'm bringing donuts and coffee, okay? So <laughs> I apologize in advance, but I think it's gonna be easy. Okay, so a huge shout out to Patrick uh, at Those Guys Customs. They took care of the Raptor really quick. When I did it a year ago, it took me it took me like the whole afternoon. All right, and uh, these guys are professional. They have all the tools. It you know it took them 45 minutes, if that. And it's like kind of a complicated system for just a cold air intake because you do have to swap out the coolant reservoir tank. But you can see super clean, super clean system here. Just bolts right to the throttle body. So now we have full Corsa intake, full Corsa exhaust, Cook's long tube headers. Pretty much all we have to do now is tune the truck. So uh, the guys over at Five Star, we have been chatting. I think they're gonna send over a tune now that the truck is running good and we have intake headers exhaust on the truck. So we should be able to, I don't know, maybe pick up 30 or 40 horsepower and also some trans tuning and you know, might make it a little more fun. Um, not that the Raptor's not already fun, right? So uh, that's it, stay tuned for that. Jason Andrews, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.